Hi everyone, welcome back. So today we are going to learn to write a program to accept the strings which contains all vowels. Okay, so we know the vowels. A, E, we know the vowels. A, E, I, O, U. So if the given string contains all these vowels, then our code should print accepted or else not accepted. Okay, so let's begin by defining a function pf oval pf oval string. Okay, first let's convert this given string into the lower case. So when you convert this into lower case, it will be easy to us to manipulate this string. Okay, string is equal to so we can convert into the lower case using string dot lower dot lower let's create a variable to assign these vowels okay vowels is equal to set of e i o u so don't think about this uh, set i just use this for unique values okay Create an another empty set. S is equal to set. Now the main theme here is I will check every character of the string. I will check every character of the given string and I will compare that character with these vowels. Okay. So if that character is a vowel, then simply add those characters to this set. Okay. Finally, I will compare the lengths of these two variables, s and vowels. Okay, so if both are equal, then it should print accepted. Okay, let's move ahead and use for loop to iterate over the string. For character in a string, if that character present in vowels, then simply Add that vowel to the s s dot and character. Okay, so this is pass. Pass means it doesn't do anything. One minute. Okay, so if the character is present in oval, then simply add that character to this s variable or else pass. Pass means it doesn't do anything. It simply move to the next step. Okay. So finally, if length of s is equal to length of vowels. So simply print accepted else print not accepted. Okay. See, I use a set here because I only want unique values. So if you use list here and if our string contains some values multiple times, the list access only duplicate values. That's why I'm using set to take unique values. Okay. Let's send this by passing a string check. Perfect plan B. You can see that uh, our string doesn't contain all vowels. So it it should return, it should print not accepted. Check print is not, check is not defined. Sorry. A string is not, a function is not check. It's all. Next on this. S. So as we assume that it should print not accepted, it prints not accepted. Let's take another example. 
the past all always a e i o u just check great accepted because the given stick contains all vowels okay okay guys thank you so much keep on practice thank you bye bye